learning task 2, letter C, numbers 1 to 5 on page 14. And this is finding the 10th term of the following geometric progressions. Okay, number 1, we have 4, 20, 100. So, ang kukunin muna natin is yung kanyang ratio. So, R, ito, di-divide dito sa 4, or yung 100, di-divide natin sa 20. So, we have 20 divided by 4. So, ang ating ratio ay 5. 100 divided by 20 is equal to 5 also. So, ito ay geometric sequence or geometric progression. So, ang A natin dito, A sa buwan natin ay yung first term na 4. Tapos, ang number of terms A natin ay 10. So, we have 10 here. Anong formula natin para makuha ang 10 term or yung last term ng ating geometric progression? Ito ang ating formula, A sub N, yung last term. A sub 1 ay yung first term. R ay yung ratio raised to the N minus 1. So, yung exponent na N minus 1. And then, exponent muna to the N minus 1. Tapos, yung result ita times natin sa first term A sub 1. Is equal to yung first term muna, A sub 1. Ayun. Which is 4. Tapos, ilagay natin sa parenthesis yung R. So, pakat i-raise natin yun siya sa n minus 1. So, ang n o r natin is 5. Yung n natin ay 10 minus 1 lagi. Okay, dito na natin lagay. So, 4 muna. Huwag ita times ng 5. Doon muna tayo. So, yung 5 natin 10 minus 1 ay to the ninth. 9 power equals 4 ulit times, oh, kukunin natin yung 5 raised to the ninth. At ang pagkuha ng 5 raised to the ninth, dito natin ilagay 5. Tapos may makikita kayo sa calculator ninyo, may ganyan. Pin-press ang 5. Pagkatapos ito, kina ito, X. Meron ditong parang ganyan. And then, press yung 9. So, sa calculator display nyo, may 5 doon. Tapos, may karet. Ganon. Tapos, lalabas yung 9. And then, equals. And then, ayan. Yun na ang 5 to the 9th. So, 5... Yun, tapos 9 equals at ito ay 195 3125 3125 Tapos times 4 Ita-times na lang ninyo ng 4 So, A to the nth ninyo so, yung A to the 10th is 781 2, 5, 0, 0. 7,812,500. Yun ang A to the 10th ng ating geometric progression number 1. Number 2. Number 2, 4, negative 6, 9. So, ang ating R, solve muna natin. 
negative 6, okay, negative 6, divided by 4. Kunin natin ang lowest term. Negative siya. Negative over positive is negative. Negative siya. Okay. By 2. 6 divided by 2 is 3. 4 divided by 2 is 2. So, negative 3 halves. Okay. A sub 1 natin. I 4. So, ito ay 4. Ang n natin, ganun pa rin, 10 term, n equals 10. Okay. A sub, n, no. A to the 10th, 10, 10 pa rin, 10 term pa rin kukunin. A sub 1, so ay 4, times, yung r is negative 3, over 2 raised to the 10 minus 1 equals yung 4 pa rin siya and then negative 3 over 2 to the 9th 9th na siya 10 minus 1 9 and then equals 4 pa rin siya and then ito ang negative raised to the add exponent ang answer ay negative negative raised to an even exponent ang sign ng final answer will be positive so itong negative ang exponent Natin ngayon is add number, an add number, 9. Therefore, ang final sign natin dito is negative. Huwag mong kalilimutan, kapag ang exponent ay nagtatapos sa 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, even numbers, kapag ito'y negative, magiging positive yung final product. Okay? Pag add naman ito, number na 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, ang sign nito ay negative pa din. Yun ang rule. So, we have negative there. So, 3 to the 9th, kung ang calculator natin, yung 3, pindutin, x to, and to the 9th. At siya ay 1, 196.83 So, ayan. And then, yung 2, pindutin din yun ang 2 rin dito. 2, ito, and then to the ninth then So, si ay 512. Nag lowest term tayo dito. So, lowest term na rin siya ron. To the ninth. Times 4. O, dito na tayo. Times 4. Ngayon, ang nung sign muna. Itong positive na 4 times a negative. Unlike signs in multiplication is negative. So, ang sign natin ng a to the tenth dito ay negative. Negative. Ngayon, i-lowest term na muna natin itong 4 at 5, 12. Huwag nang i-times. I-lowest term na natin. Tingnan natin kung pwedeng divide ng 4 ito. Of course, 1. Pwedeng divide mo ng 4. Exacto ba siya? 5, 12 divided by 4. Kung pwede, yun ang lowest term niya. Magiging 1 ito times na sa 196. So, siya, yun natin dito. 512 divided by 4 is equal to 128. Ito. 128. At yung itaas ay 196. 83 pa din. 
So, our final answer here is ito. Negative 196. 83 over 128. Number 3 class, we have negative 2, 6, negative 18. So, alternate ang negative, positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative, positive. 10 term pa rin ang kukunin natin. So, R muna tayo para malaman natin kung siya ay uh, geometric progression o geometric sequence. So, ang R natin is 6 divided by negative 2 here. So, 6 negative 2 is negative 3. Yun ang ating ratio. Check natin dito. Negative 18 divided by 6 is also negative 3. So, constant ang ratio siya geometric sequence. A sub 1, para sa formula natin, A sub 1, yeah, yung first term is negative 2. Ayan. Tapos, ang kukunin natin na yung 10th term. So, ang N natin is 10. Okay, substitute natin sa ating formula. A sub 10 is equal to A sub 1. It is negative 2. Parenthesis R. It is negative 3. Times or raised to the 10 minus 1. Diretso na natin, class. So, we have negative 2. And then, negative 3 raised to the ninth power. Equals, so dito na. Negative 2, kopya pa rin negative 2. O, mag -re raise na tayo to the ninth ng negative 3. Negative ito, raised to the ninth power, ang 9 ay add number. So, add exponent siya. So, itong negative nito, ang final sign niya is negative. So, 3 to the ninth. O, kuha ang calculator ninyo. 3 x to the ninth equals, so ito ay 1, 9, 6, 83. So, 19683. Yung 3 to the 9th. Ito. Tapos, times na tayo. So, A to the 10th. O, A sub 10. O, 10th. A 10th is negative times negative. Sa multiplication, pag like signs ay positive. So, ito ay magiging positive na. So, huwag na natin ilagay yung cross. I-multiply na lang natin itong 196.83 sa 2. So, times 2. And we have 3, 9, 3, 6, 6. And this is the 10th term of our geometric progression. Negative 2, 6, negative 8.